Getting some ideas on welding machine? These improvised welding machines will inspire you. Here at MechMinds Hub, where our knowledge and mechanics combine. Let's jump right in. A mini welding machine made from a 12 volt battery. This is a simple and cheap way to create a welding machine that can be used for small repairs. The battery provides the power source and the electrodes are made from copper rods. The copper rods are connected to the battery terminals with wires and a switch is added to control the current flow. To weld, you just need to touch the copper rods to the metal pieces that you want to join and the current will create enough heat to melt and fuse them together. You don't need expensive or complicated equipment to do welding. You can use a common household item like a battery and some basic materials like copper rods and wires to create a functional welding device. You can also adjust the size and power of the battery according to your needs and preferences. This mini welding machine is suitable for welding thin metals like tin cans, wires, or nails. But you can also use a bigger battery or multiple batteries in series to increase the voltage and current and weld thicker metals. The next improvised welding machine is a portable welding machine that uses an inverter technology. An inverter is a device that converts direct current to alternating current or vice versa. Inverter welding machines use DC power sources like batteries or generators and convert them to AC power that can be used for welding. Inverter welding machines have many advantages over conventional welding machines that use AC power sources like mains electricity. They are more efficient, more stable, more precise, and more adaptable. They can also be smaller and lighter making them easier to carry and use in different locations. There are many types and models of inverter welding machines available in the market, but you can also make your own using some electronic components like transistors, diodes, capacitors, resistors, and transformers. You can use your own skills and knowledge to create a high-performance welding machine that can rival the commercial ones. Customize the inverter welding machine according to your needs and preferences, such as the power output, the welding method, the welding current, and the welding arc. Use inverter welding machine for various welding applications, such as metal art, fabrication, repair, or construction. The third improvised machine is a spot welding machine that uses a microwave oven transformer. A spot welding machine is a type of welding machine that can join metal pieces together by creating a small weld at a specific point. Spot welding is often used for joining sheet metals, such as in car bodies, appliances, or furniture. Spot welding machines usually use high-voltage AC power sources and electrodes that are shaped like clamps or tongs. The electrodes are used to apply pressure and current to the metal pieces at the spot where they are to be joined, and the current creates enough heat to melt and fuse them together. A spot welding machine can be made from a microwave oven transformer, which is a device that converts low-voltage AC power to high-voltage AC power. The microwave oven transformer can be modified by removing the secondary coil and replacing it with a thicker wire that can handle more current. The primary coil is connected to a power source, such as a wall outlet or an extension cord, and the secondary coil is connected to the electrodes, which can be made from copper or steel rods. A switch is added to control the current flow, and a timer is added to control the welding duration. This spot welding machine is inspiring because you can reuse and repurpose an old or broken appliance like a microwave oven and turn it into a useful and powerful welding machine. You can save money and resources by using a microwave oven transformer instead of buying a new spot welding machine. Use spot welding machine for joining various types of sheet metals such as steel, aluminum, or copper and create different shapes and designs. Another one more example of an improvised welding machine is a gas welding machine that uses a propane torch and a bicycle pump. Gas welding is a type of welding that uses a flame to heat and melt the metal pieces that are to be joined. Gas welding usually requires a gas cylinder and a regulator to supply and control the gas flow. 
but you can also make your own gas welding machine using a propane torch and a bicycle pump. A propane torch is a device that produces a flame by burning propane gas. You can find propane torches in hardware stores or online, and they are often used for soldering, brazing, or heating. A bicycle pump is a device that pumps air into bicycle tires. You can use a bicycle pump to increase the pressure and flow of the propane gas, making the flame hotter and stronger. To make a gas welding machine from a propane torch and a bicycle pump, you will need some additional materials, such as a hose, a valve, a pressure gauge, and a welding tip. Adjust the pressure and flow of the propane gas by using the bicycle pump and the valve, making the flame suitable for different welding applications. Use the gas welding machine for welding various types of metals, such as steel, copper, or brass, and create different shapes and designs. This one is a plasma cutter that uses a car battery and a spark plug. A plasma cutter is a type of welding machine that can cut through metal using a jet of hot plasma. Plasma is a state of matter that consists of ionized gas, which can conduct electricity and generate heat. Plasma cutters usually use a high-voltage power source and a compressed gas to create and control the plasma jet. A plasma cutter can be made from a car battery and a spark plug, which are both common and cheap items. The car battery provides the power source and the spark plug provides the ignition. The spark plug is connected to the positive terminal of the battery with a wire, and a switch is added to control the current flow. The negative terminal of the battery is connected to the metal piece that is to be cut. A hose is attached to the spark plug and a compressed gas, such as air or propane, is supplied through the hose. To cut, you just need to turn on the switch and move the spark plug along the metal piece. The spark plug will create a spark that will ionize the gas and form a plasma jet. The plasma jet will melt and blow away the metal, creating a clean and precise cut. Adjust the gas pressure and flow to change the intensity and size of the plasma jet. Use the plasma cutter for cutting various types of metals, such as steel, aluminum, or copper, and create different shapes and designs. These improvised welding machines will surely help you with welding projects. Improvised welding machines are not only fun and interesting, but they are also practical and useful. Always remember to adhere to safety measures while engaging in welding activities. Did you find these improvised welding machines inspiring? If so, please give this video a thumbs up, like, share, and subscribe to MechMind's Hub channel. Thank you for watching.